Microsurvey CAD 2014 includes a new 2D draw mode. What we're looking at right now in the drawing is a topographic survey that's been imported. And if we rotate to a 3D ISO view, you're going to see that the actual nodes for the points that were measured are in 3D space, and that's 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 normal. A lot of our users want to be able to uh, have all of their line work that they're drawing always at elevation zero, and so to accomplish that, we've added a new 2D mode. When you enable it, you're going to see that all of those 3D points are now at elevation zero. But there's some important features that are built into this new 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 option. If I click on point 192, you're going to see that we still know what the 3D coordinate is for that point, and we can still dis uh, display to you what its true elevation is, even though the CAD node is at zero. Same thing if we look at our point database. You're going to see all the coordinates in here are all 3D. So if I was to, let's just co-go a line in here between two points. So you're going to see we're going from point 1 to 101. Both of those points have a 3D coordinate, which we can see here by the elevations. And if I label that, and we click on the line, you'll see that we still list the 3D coordinates for the line. We can compute its slope and grade. And if I ro rotate this drawing again into an ISO view, you're going to see that the line is at elevation zero or drawn in 2D. And so even with this new mode, we still have all of our connectivity to the database. And if you want to turn off 2D mode, you certainly can. And when you do so, all of your points will be back in 3D space. And you can just toggle back and forth between the two modes if you want, but I believe most users who need that functionality will just leave it set to 2D draw mode. 